Hoy les traemos fútbol femenino de la NCAA División 2. Hoy se enfrentan los MSU Corre Caminos contra los Cougars de Colorado Christian University. Y aquí la pelota está en camino. Empezamos este partido de fútbol en este domingo hermoso en el centro de Denver. Cuando viene la defensa, mientras aquí están García. García con la pelota. García, recorte. Tiro y a las manos del arquero. Muy buen arquero para los Cougars. Pero los Cougars pierden esa pelota en la defensa. Ahora viene Jimmy Swagger. Jimmy Swagger con el tiro. Disparo. Gol. Para los Core Caminos en el 4 minuto. Jamie Swagger. Probado de Coates. Coates tiene a Dean. Dean sigue el área. Dean parece todo. Solo el disparo. Atajadón de la arquera. Ahí viene el centro. El corazón de la área de la arquera. Para los Cougars. Y si termina el primer tiempo de este partido. 1 a 0 a favor de los core caminos de MSU Denver. Se recupera la pelota. La baja bien. Tiene a Sawager metiendo la corrida. Sawager va a alcanzar la pelota. Sawager dentro del área. Tiro. Y el arquero. Para Gold. Gold. Lo regresa para Sawager. Sawager va a meter el tiro al arco. Y suba buscando la corrida de Katie Coates. Y ahora Katie Coates está sola. Sale Elena Lope de la área. Elena Lope. Va a meter el centro de la pelota. Centro del centro de la área. Y otra vez atajadón del arquero Elena Lope. Pero Luna García en todavía posición. Luna García con un tiro. Y otro gol para los core caminos. MSU Denver Roadrunners. Ya con dos goles al favor. Luna García. Registrando su segundo gol en esta temporada 2022. Y se termina el partido. MSU Denver 2, Colorado Christian University. It's so good. We can do it. I know we can do it. It's just a matter of, you know, getting that final pass down and putting it back in the net. So it feels really good. Something we pride ourselves on is being undefeated at home, and we've been carrying that on since last fall, so that's awesome. Uh, we call them big five moments, um, and that's when you score a goal in the first five minutes, and that's exactly what we did. So that, I think, really just got us going and set the tone for the game and what that was going to be like. Um, and yeah, Jamie's the best. She's, she can score goals. I love it. <laughs> really good because we always talk about big five, like scoring within the first five minutes. Um, it really set our pace. Like we knew we wanted to get another one and we just kept going at them. So I think her goal really like helped us, you know, like set the pace for the game. Honestly, I don't really remember. I just know I was exhausted. So I was kind of like hanging out like outside the box and just like waiting to see what was going to happen and then I saw it pop out and I thought just beat the defender to it and I just like touched it and then shot it and it happened to go in. It has me sit on top of the box just to get anything that comes out and yeah kind of just put it back in which yeah. You know it couldn't be a simple tap in it had to be an upper 90 top of the you know we'll, we'll take it though like uh, Luna's been playing really well she's been having fun and for her to be in the right spot right there to get that second ball that popped out was fantastic. So uh, proud of her, proud of her effort. Players worked really, really hard to create those opportunities. I mean, we were knocking at the door. Their goalkeeper made some really good saves. Um, our decision-making still needs to be a little bit sharper, but if you're creating that many chances, and um, I didn't see the final stats, so I wasn't sure how many on frame it was. Nine. Nine. So that's that's great. Um, <clears throat> we just always a really good team too. Um, so we definitely got to make sure we have a good week going into training, have a good re-entry day on Tuesday, um, and just make sure we're locked in and ready to get the three points on Thursday. So with that, Regis is a good team. They're well coached, new coach. Um, they're going to be energized. It's. You know, it's a big rivalry and we need to make sure that we're ready and we're prepared uh, leading into that game. And if we've got the right mindset, um, I'm excited to see what we can do.